Yeezy this, Yeezy that. The Yeezy Calabasas power phase ain't better than that. Stay tuned. Welcome to Casa Station where we talk sneakers. My name is Zoe, and if you're here for the first time, make sure that you subscribe and even hit that notification button so you don't miss any dope sneaker content. What you've all been waiting for, the Nike Lab Air Max 1 Pinnacle in the sale colorway. These sneakers are dope, guys. You really, really understand that when you see the leather on the sneaker. It is super buttery. When you're talking about tumbled leather, Tumbled leather. Tumbled leather. This is the epitome of it right here. Anyways, the leather around the whole sneaker is what you're always wishing for when it comes to Air Jordan 1s, when it comes to Nike sneakers in general, etc, etc. And I'm really excited about this shoe because it's perfect for the summertime. And I believe it's really being slept on by the sneaker community given that it has good quality leather and in addition to that, it has a simple color for the summer. But anyways, let's get straight into the sneaker review, guys. So looking on the inside of the shoe, you'll notice that it has the Nike Air insignia as usual. On the top of the shoe and the entire upper is covered in a rich, buttery, tumbled leather that we're all seeking and looking and craving for as sneaker fanatics. It seems like it's a bland color, but to me, if you wear this with the right jeans, the right top, it, it sticks out really, really well. And that's the thing about sneakers. When you buy sneakers, it's not just about the sneaker. It's about the entire outfit and how it coordinates, how it comes together. So you have to always take that into consideration. So the midsole and outsole of the sneaker is made up of synthetic rubber and it also comes with the air unit that all Air Max 1s are known for. In addition to that, it is in the sale colorway. So Casa question of the day, guys. Which sneaker is better in your opinion? The Nike Lab Air Max 1 Pinnacle or the Yeezy Calabasas? In my opinion, this guy right here beats out the Calabasas every single time, hands down. For me, the price point was the same. I bought these bad boys for 120 bucks while the Calabasas was going for 120 bucks retail. Oh heck no. I had to interrupt myself guys because I forgot to tell you that the Yeezy Calabasas is going for up to $1,300. Be responsible. Don't buy that shoe for $1,300. Anyways, I just had to let you guys know. In addition to that, the colorways are similar. Both have that off-white, sale-looking color. Both of them have that 90s feel that's, you know, really getting popular right now. And, you know, this shoe was first made in 1987. It was worn and, you know, very popular throughout the 90s, the early 90s. So, you know, if you're looking for the 90s feel, you can still get it from an Air Max 1, FYI. And finally, this sneaker right here, the Nike Air Max 1 Pinnacle, has no hype whatsoever. It's being slept on by the sneaker community again. I wonder why. I don't know if it's because it's a bland colorway, but hmm, the Power Face Calabasas also has the bland off-white colorway as well, but everybody wants to wear it because His Highness Kanye West wore them. And so that makes it super hype. The hype beasts are all over them, and I'm not big on hype. I truly buy what I like. This sneaker right here is bland, but like I said before, it's the whole outfit that brings the sneaker together, that really showcases the sneaker. The pricing for this sneaker ranges from 140 bucks to 160 dollars retail. I bought it for 120 bucks, given that sneakers and stuff was having a dope sale, so I capitalized on that and bought them at the time. I'll put some links down below, and maybe if I see any sales, I'll let you guys know as well if you're interested in purchasing them at all. I believe that these sneakers go true to size, although I went a half size down, and it's still comfortable for me. A little bit snug, but not snug enough where it's uncomfortable so TTS guys hey guys so my sneaker talk is up please remember to like comment share and subscribe make sure you share it with other people that love sneakers so that we could build this community up 
Anyways, I'll see you all on the next episode of Casa Station Deuces. Hey guys, if you want to watch more sneaker videos that are dope sauce, go ahead and subscribe by clicking the link down below that says Casa Station. My name is Zoe, and until next time, deuces.